And when the clock hit 8 o'clock this evening, all public and private golf courses in Onondaga County had to close until April 28th. This by executive order from Brian McMahon. He says we've got to go hard the next two weeks to flatten the curve. News Channel 9's Josh Martin has a closer look tonight. We're asking kids not to go on play dates. So why do the adults get to go on play dates? Players teed it up for the last time Monday. Onondaga County closing golf courses at 8 o'clock until the end of the month at least. Golf was allowed previously under strict guidelines, but not anymore, as social distancing continues to be a problem across central New York. We believe when we're looking at social distancing, based off of caseloads we've seen uh, related to social gatherings, looking at some of the other thermo uh, GIS mapping related to uh, different density in different parts of the county, that this short-term pain uh, for some of our golf courses and uh, inconvenience for some of our golfers could lead to long-term success for the region. The only golf course that will be open in Onondaga County is here at Green Lakes. It's a state-run facility. Onondaga County has asked the state to close it down. It is yet to do so. The county executive wouldn't get into specifics if golf played any factor in developing new cases in Onondaga County, but did say it had to do with bad social distancing and told us we can connect the dots. Josh Morton, News Channel 9. Josh, thank you. Onondaga County is anticipating other counties in central New York will follow through and ban golfing as well. As of now, no formal announcements from other counties have been made.